United Arab Emirates news agency The National reports that brutal beatings, electric shocks, and sexual humiliation will be the cornerstones of a case brought by Mamdou Habib, a former Guantanamo Bay detainee from Australia, who is suing his government over his alleged torture and captivity. Habib insists that Australian consular representatives were present when he was abused in detention following his arrest on suspicion of involvement in terrorism in Pakistan in 2001, before he was transferred to Egypt and Afghanistan. The former cafe owner was later flown to the U.S. prison camp at Guantanamo Bay in Cuba and held without trial for over three years. Habib says he has flashbacks almost every day of the cruelty he endured. He says that while he was imprisoned in Pakistan, his torture included electric shocks from car batteries and beatings. Habib said, quote, Whatever compensation they give me is not enough. I want to see the people who harmed me in jail. I want these people to be punished. The Australian government is covering up corruption and the crimes against me. I want the world to know. The Habib family says their campaign is not just about restitution, but to add their voices to the clamor for the United States prison in Guantanamo to be closed and for Australia's counterterrorism legislation introduced after the events of September 11, 2001 to be repealed. The Australian government denies Habib's allegations.